Uh, first and foremost, I would like to inform you that uh, I'm also here under the auspice of the of Vegas State House Assembly, that are the leadership of the who graciously been making so much noise in the house that when the waitings are going, they got to do something about the you are the suffrage of the people because we live around them and we know exactly what is going on. And that's the reason why we are using all facets to tackle the issues. Both, both the senator, both uh, the House, House of Reps, both the council chairman and myself. We are also, also at our own level also trying to do one thing or the other to just make sure we give back to society at this peculiar time. Because it's not, palliative is not something we are also very proud of. People are not beggars. But when situations like this happens, we need to do something urgently. Because and that's the essence of them voting for us. So it's not only when we need their votes that we go to them. We should also feel their pains. And yes, the economic situation is global. Everybody is facing it now. But the point is that as representative of the people, we must also feel what they are feeling. And at any point in time, take up a strategic move to assist. And that's the reason why we are people who are doing well in the state can be supported from you know part of the those who can yeah I, I, I quite agree with you if you look at the the vision and the program of APC as a party being championed by the current president of the nation Natural Jibola Metu who I'm also happy to have worked with I know him he's going to work around 360 degrees to ensure things and it doesn't happen just like that and you could see all his movements since inception till date. He has been moving around to make sure things are back to normal. And you can even see the dollar rate coming down now. So we should expect that just like he said, we'll have to go through some pains to start enjoyment, to start enjoying it. The, the, the most important thing is that we are talking about somebody whom we know who has practicalized his here in Lagos. And his vision is to sustain us in Lagos till date. And as far as Lagos is concerned, I can, you can be rest assured that all of us, including the government, the governor and everything, last week we had a party whereby we were able to come out and look at the current situation of things and what we need to do more. And we rest assured, Lagos is an hub that is ready. If you look at the teams of the, of the governor, you look at every facet of the society is taken care of. And we are going to pursue those visions just to ensure that we have that people have the so of the promises we gave them. And if you look at the, the caliber of people that are in the House of Assembly and even the commissioners, if you know what, what they went through before they passed through the procedures, then you know that we really mean business this time around. Okay, fine. Lastly, from you, the, the, your message to these vendors here, because governments will roll out a program. If it's not well managed, it can be rubbish. And at the end of the day, you may not get the benefit of that program. So what would be your message to whoever is going to is participating in this own GFO that is a vendor, then the people themselves in this constituency, what are your advice to them? First and foremost, let me start with the people. I'm encouraged with the orderliness, unlike what we see the previous one. I see that they are more organized they are, and they are patient enough, despite discussion in the rain, which will try and take care of in the next coming one. So I, I want to appreciate them, I want to thank them for their patience and for being orderly. For the vendors, even some of the vendors I see are not even on ground. That we also look at and take care of in the next one. And for what those of them are on ground, they should anticipate that the crowd will continue to increase. It is not what we see this Sunday that we're going to see the next week Sunday. The more we have this thing, because it's bringing soccer to them, the more people they should be expecting. So they should be more proactive and get themselves more organized than what I've seen here today. Yes, they've been trying and I could see a lot of um, other um, vendors coming in, especially the, the, the monetary aspect that they are still organized to, for those who could not go through this thing to collect their their tickets that we are very pleased of but like i said they should be more proactive in bringing in more goods for the people that they don't spend so much time waiting and then 
And then buy the what they really want. I have noticed that. I've noticed those that are not available. And if between now and next week, I'm going to make my report so that we could go and make sure they are available next week. Sometime.